Okay, so it is Friday, but more importantly, hello, it is Valentine's Day. Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Um, things are crazy in relation to COVID here in St. Lucia. Um, but I'm running around today. I'm going to take you all with me. I have some errands to run, so... Let's see how it goes. It's a real struggle trying to get your headphones through your mask and your earrings. Am I the only person who always gets it tangled up? Let me know in the comments if you're having the same issue and what you would recommend. Yeah. A mess. Anyway, we're on our way to road media. We have to take a line for everything and the things that we had to take a line for before COVID, the lines are much longer. So um, at the pharmacy, I have to get some top up and I also have to grab some other little things. Fail. Okay. And I need to get some water and then I'll be out of Rodney Bay. So, gotta cast it and get out of here. Okay. So now we're heading to town. This is where the bus stand is now. Used to be over there by KFC. Now it's here. Shoot, I just miss a bus. So now I have to wait for the bus to fall, but thankfully it's only 10 people, so fingers crossed we can leave soon. Yeah, I hope. Almost 11, I'm heading to OKU and then I have a rehearsal. Yeah, I'm gonna be late for my rehearsal. But I have to, have to, have to stop there first. So I couldn't um, film at the hospital and I was on a work call, but I'm running to my rehearsal. Wow, sorry. I'm running to my rehearsal. Um, I'm already late. So yeah, it's a very busy day. Meanwhile, I haven't even had breakfast, but it's not, I don't normally eat breakfast. I have water, so I'll survive. Done with my rehearsal. Oops. Okay. Heading back to the pharmacy and then home. Okay, so I was able to get everything at that pharmacy. Um, well, everything that I was missing that I didn't get at Super J this morning. Um, sorry. Ooh, push. I. Just came from the ATM, thank God. There was no line this time. I'm going to get a slice of cake from Dr. Freezer's because I feel like I deserve it. And then we'll see where we go from there. Oh, I broke a nail. You'll see where it's broken, eh? And to cry because I don't know what I'm going to do. I might have to cut it. I have a show tonight. So I am back home. Um, the two things I didn't show y'all. I went to get these. This is um, 
ginger it's sugar coated is it caramelized ginger i always get it when i have a gig yeah it's like my snack um and in the last vlog i don't know if you all remember i told you all you see my face still a mess because every time it heals i start scratching it i have a problem don't be like me y'all so anyway in the last vlog i told you all um that i was waiting on um a company that i saw online a, a solution company that i saw with very good reviews on skincare so i was waiting on them to get their products so i bought something from them this morning i picked that up as well so i'm gonna show it to you guys and then i'll let you all know like if it works i hope it does it was very affordable so, so the name of the company is natural skin glow um you can see it here they comes with a card so you know how to contact them this is the soap that i bought it's a turmeric and lavender soap so i hope that it works i've seen really good reviews on instagram so i'll let you all know how it goes natural skin glow 758 sidebar i need to i need to figure out what i'm doing about my nail i need to cut it wish me luck guys wish me luck What could hurt more than a heartbreak or what could hurt more than a breakup or whatever? Can you break a nail? And especially if you have acrylics? So I am about to go on. Um, nothing much to tell about this dress it's a borrowed dress actually um it's from the sisterhood <laughs> the sisterhood of the traveling gowns so this um, is a borrowed dress from one of my shuttle sisters um we were doing a gig and i was actually gonna buy a gown but then she said like you know girl you can save money i'ma just borrow you one and we were about the same height so yeah i've met some really nice people in this industry like the singers, my mask for him. So yeah, I ain't got no problem with second hand. Look at my booty. Oh. Yes, look at her, honey. Look at her. She ready. Anyway, thanks, sis. I know. I don't think she want me to say her name and everything, so I'll just leave it at that. Gotta go. I'm on in. I'm on in ten minutes. It's gonna be a great show in Jesus' name. It's gonna be a great show in Jesus' name. Show in Jesus' name, amen. Morning, guys. We heading to work. Hi, guys. So I'm heading home from work. Me and my lemons <laughs> that Sam bought me for my mom. If you are away from home or if you're freezing in the cold these are the sunsets that you're missing yeah i have to stop in the supermarkets um i'm trying to get hold of some cranberry tea bags so i have to make a stop in the supermarkets and get home before curfew curfew is now at seven o'clock so we have a seven to five curfew. So yeah, I think the fine is like ten thousand dollars or six months in jail, something to that effect. Neither of which I can afford. Not after seeing the toilets. Yeah. Thanks to the BCF monsters, I got a little view of the toilets inside of the jail. And I don't need to go there. <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to the supermarket now. I hope I could get there before it closes. So I'm not seeing any 
Canberry Chivas. Except those, so I guess I'm gonna take these. Okay, now I need extra. Now I need organic olive oil. Okay. One of these is, she said it should say organic on it. Um, I think I'm gonna take one of these. I just want some grapes. I am low key addicted, in fact, high key, high key addicted to grapes. Um, I used to be able to get grapes for like $5, $6. Now, if I get them below eight dollars, uh oh, things falling. If I get them below eight dollars, I'm lucky. Got it. Okay, let's get out of here. That's it for my day. I'm heading home. Anyway, there's been a lot of debates about the CDCs. Some people find they look like secondary schools, but I find. They kind of, they look well, they look much better than what they were before. And the colors, just in time for independence. I ain't mad at it. Anyway, I'm heading to the bus stand so I can get home before curfew. I have 45 minutes. Okay, so it is Friday, but more importantly, hello, it is Valentine's Day. <laughs> well, technically, Valentine's Day is on Sunday, but it's the Friday of Valentine. It's Valentine's Friday. Okay, I may try dress today because I'm not letting COVID stop my flow. Okay, it's Valentine's Day. Even though, like normally, we would have a really big celebration. We would have exchange of gifts because we normally do Valpal, which I am so sad about because it used to really be the bomb like that in terms of social activities at work. That was like maybe like number one in terms of most successful. We would have like a big party in the afternoon with food and then we exchange gifts and then we dance and we have a little fete. We can't do any of that this year. But you all know I am queen of treating myself. No shame in my game. So I ordered um, treats from Cakes by Cassie, of course. Of course. And I also ordered from Lloyd. Lloyd's Cupcakery. But I think I'm going to get Lloyd's tomorrow. But Cakes by Cassie came. So let me show it to y'all. This is the Valentine's Day Love Box special from Cakes by Cassie. Go follow them on Instagram, guys. The cakes are bomb. Yes. Oh, I have some cupcakes. Chocolate covered strawberries. Brownie cookies. Or brownies. I'm not too sure. I don't remember what I ordered. And a bottle of wine. Bottle of wine. You don't know how happy I am to see a bottle of wine and white wine again. My wine finished, and the government has put a ban on alcohol. So, you're not not saying that, of course. So, I went downstairs to pick up my order from Cakes by Cassie, and she's telling me that there's an additional order for me. So, let me show it to y'all. So apparently, um, the Mr. Man made an order for me. <laughs> My lips are so dry. Sorry, y'all. The ghetto. Very sneaky of him. Um, but yeah. I'm not surprised. A lot of people feel like I buy things for myself because my boyfriend is not romantic. He's very romantic, by the way. I just like myself. Eh -eh. So if I see something and it look like me, I'm taking it. Eh -eh. I mean, I don't know. I can't always wait for people to buy things for me. I buy things for myself. But he buys, he's very good at gifts. Well, you also from the shoes and other things that were never on camera. But yeah, so a little extra. So Valentine's Day is looking good for me so far. The interesting thing about this is that I didn't know that he was going to send me something. But I but I arranged to send him something. I wonder if he found out. That's why he tried to be sneaky. 
anyway when last y'all buy a quiche from um the shop by the mon stand like the pizza shop i wish you could smell it it smells so good this is what i'm having for lunch today and some water um i'm trying to do portion control so i only have one large meal for the day so it's probably gonna be well it's gonna be dinner because i didn't have breakfast this morning i don't normally do breakfast it's a serious problem so I'm, what, I'm, what I want to start doing is maybe like a cup of tea in the morning or something, but I don't normally do anything. I just had some grapes this morning um, and water. Now I'm having a quiche. I have two of them and water. And then I'll have a big dinner, maybe, or a sandwich or something. Yes. I love these. And it smells so good. But it's not good for me. Huh? But treat yourself, Valentine's Friday continues. This is for me. Amen. I finished my quiche. I'm gonna have one of my cupcakes. Just one. Just one. Y'all judging me? You have that, okay? It's Valentine's Day. I'm having a cupcake or two. I don't know. I'm gonna have one of those from my boozy. I have those from one from what Jack sent. self-care valentine's day weekend this is my fragrance oil melt yes so because sms is closed i can't get my regular oil so i bought these at, S at mnc i don't feel like they're supposed to be lit so i didn't put too too much um on top of the fire but it smells really good in here so um i think i'm gonna end it here guys for the week um, you'll see the rest of the weekend next week. Um, yeah, I think it's a good, it's starting off to be a good Valentine's Day weekend. I've been reading a lot of tweets about people who say that they don't believe in Valentine's. Okay. To each its own. And that's all I'm going to say about that because, like I said, I cannot... I can't date somebody that doesn't believe in Valentine's. Because it's it just lazy. Yeah, it could be Valentine's every day, okay, but. You don't believe in Valentine's? You can't even get me a lollipop, a, a piece of a flower, a leaf, nothing? I don't know. My stepfather got my mother some flowers, honey. <laughs> love it for her. I love it. Because she said she was so surprised. Like, she didn't, she wasn't expecting anything. Yes, you need to do, it's an opportunity to just show a little extra love. So, yeah, you show love every day, but you show a little extra, I don't know. To each its own, like I said, it won't work for me. But if it works for you, yeah. Different people. Anyway, y'all, so I'm going to sign off here. Um... Thank you for running all my errands with me, <laughs> if you're still here. I hope you're all still here. You all go already. Thank you for running all my errands with me this week. Um, hopefully next week, I'll have something more exciting for you guys. <sighs> the cases are crazy here. I mean, just yesterday, we and our cases are like in the 200s daily. It may not seem like a lot to people who are viewing from huge countries, but for our little island, 200 cases per day is a lot. Like, yeah. So I'm trying to limit my movements. So the next couple of vlogs may just be me in my house doing different things. There's actually something that I want to start. I don't want to say too much about. Maybe next week's vlog. I'll give you guys a little more insight. But anyway, I'm going to check out now. So thank you guys for joining me this week. 
and i'm gonna see you guys next week of course if you have not subscribed please join the family you could hit the subscribe button down there we're, we're up to a thousand plus subscribers now so make sure you hit the bell so you won't miss my next video and of course leave a like on this video for me please and i'll see you guys next week sm pink checking out bye